Hello everyone, welcome to Work Knowledge and today we are going to register a grant stream IP phone on Cisco CUCM. So we have grant stream GRP2602 and we are copying the MAC address of the IP phone. So I have copied the MAC address. Now remove the columns between the MAC address. Now copy again the MAC address and go to CUCM and click on device and click on phone. After that click on add new and select phone type as third party SIP device basic. Click next. Enter the MAC address of your IP phone. Pasting the MAC address of uh, Grandstream phone and device pool select as default, phone button template select as third party SIP device. Then select anonymous, user we will define later after creating. Now device security profile select as uh, third party SIP device. SIP profile, standard SIP profile, digest user we are not selecting, click save, okay. After that, click uh, on user management and click user, add new user, user ID 1001, for example, I'm taking this 1001 and same password 1001. Last name, I'm giving the IP phone name GRP2602P. Then digest credentials 1001 and same copied in the confirm password credentials section. Click save. and then select the device control con under the control devices click on find and select the device with your mac address and save selected slash changes now go back to the user so our device is selected now clicking again on the save Now go back to the device and phone and select the device which we have already created right before. Now select the user and select the extension number 1001. Digest user select as 1001. Save. Now click on line one, directory number 1001, description alerting name, you can left it as 1001 or you can change as per your requirements. Now display caller ID, I'm giving GRP, 2602p you can set your name or the username now click on save after clicking save click on associate and user and select 1001, add selected, click save. So the work is done in CUCM. I can see the user is selected. Now we have to, so you can see that the device is unregistered on 
Now I'm going to the phone GRP2602P. This is a crash to my phone. Okay. I'm going to the account three, which is not configured yet. Now I'm enabling account name 1001, SIP server, CUCM IP address 192.168.1.250. Sip user ID 1001, authentication ID same 1001, and the password is 1001. Save and apply. Now wait for the phone to register on CUCM. Now going to account status. I'm refreshing the status of the phone. Once the phone is registered, its color is changed to green. So now you can see that the Account 3 is registered and its color is changed to green. And similarly, we can check IP phone status. So it is registered. Okay. Now we will test a call from account 3. So first, I'm clicking. Uh, I'm enabling click to dial option in the phone so that I can dial from here on the web interface. Just enable the click to dial feature. Now I can call from the web interface. Now I'm selecting account three and CUCM other extension that call is going to the user. So here you can see the phone is registered and we are able to make the call.